And it's musical theater month. Yes, yeah, yeah. a whole month oh. on Gloucester Fountain. Nice. We're here with none other than Ms. Rachel Rockwell in a <laughs> Chicago theater institution, the Goodman uh, Sit and Talk Shop here yeah. about Brigadoon. A stage version of this of this magnitude hasn't happened for years. 30 years, over 30, 30 years. years. Do the elevator pitch of what the storyline of Brigadoon is. The short pitch. <laughs> it's about a village that appears one day every 100 years. And you cannot leave, if anyone leaves Brigadoon, they never, they will never wake up again. It wasn't really a piece that was on my radar uh, apart from the fact that it has incredible opportunities for dance. So when she brought it up, it was like, oh, Brigadoon, I have to really, I really need to dig into this and think about it. I went right into research to see what it was that we could base the, the major plot point on. Luckily, there was plenty to pull from. The second thing I did was hire Gordon Pierce Schmidt to be my associate choreographer and I just had a feeling that we were gonna collaborate really, really well together. So <laughs> delighted by what the kilts did to the sword dance. But then you add a spinning skirt, which oh, you yeah. don't usually have on male dancers, <laughs> yeah. and it, it was a whole and other got thing. really nice legs. Oh too. yeah, they do, yeah. <laughs> yeah, really it's a nice really legs. good looking group of people. Incredible. It's Brigadoon 90210, baby. Total, and you name a very specific moment in the show that you just absolutely love. You know, I just feel really good about the fact that we gave the story a much more historical basis grounded it so that you know you could have some real emotions about yeah. about well, their plight. Luckily it all ends up it ends well. It does end well as for, most almost, musical, for almost as most everyone. Musical theater <laughs> what? productions do. It, it, it does. <laughs> can you do a Scottish accent? I can. You I can? need a text Are you good? though. I laddie. <laughs> I like words like pleasant and oh, that's and pain. Oh cuz there's yeah. devil, you know there's lots of there's lots of diphthongs and yeah the costume Mm -hmm. were incredible. All the families came on stage with the tartans. Just, Pretty oh, it's and really, powerful. Yeah, yeah. I wanted to shout like my family. <laughs> Mick Dougal. Yeah, like, absolutely. <laughs> you absolutely. <would> <laughs> I think there might have been McDougal, but we couldn't get the tartan for it. Oh really? There was also oh, so the tartans really match the family. Oh names. they oh absolutely. So. And and we were talking about the weight of the wool. She was gonna buy this 11 ounce wool and all the guys at the tartan mills were like, no, you can't do that. And she was like, why not? She goes, it's too girly. So yeah, no, they're, they're, and they're bravo, dying. Your, your they're accent dying. was really good. Oh, that was bad. Yeah, that was really good. It was so natural. <laughs> I could sit here and talk about this for hours. Well, me too. I love it. I'm, all right, well, know. next question. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Rachel, thanks so much for talking all things Brigadoon. Thanks, thanks so much. Absolutely, Let's my pleasure. Let's wave goodbye. Bye. Bye. I don't know. I need text to read. I can't just you pull can't it just out. I can't it? just whip it out. No. No. <laughs> well, I, hope, I hope you don't do that. No. <laughs>